Hey, pleasant good morning to you. I'm giving you some emergency numbers this morning. Very important emergency numbers. Uh, you must check on them. The next time I'm giving you emergency numbers, I'm going to read every text, but they're going to take long. So you have to take the emergency numbers and utilize them when that type of emergency comes your way. Uh, now, when in sorrow, call John 14. And when you call John 14, you can read from verse 1 to 3, which says, Let not your heart be troubled. Ye believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you, I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there you may be also. Uh, when men fail you, uh, call Psalm 27. The Lord is your light. Uh, when you have sinned, uh, call Psalm 51. And you can pick on verse 10, which says, Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Uh, when you worry, uh, call Matthew chapter 6. And you can read from verse 19 right on to 33. Uh, and verse uh, to verse 34, verse 33 uh, will tell you plain, but seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. When you are in danger, uh, call on Psalm 91. Yes, call on Psalm 91. Uh, when God seems far away, uh, call Psalm 139. If even you make your bed in the midst of the sea, he is there. Even there his hand shall lead you. Uh, when your faith needs stirring up, go to the faith chapter in the Bible. And that is Hebrews chapter 11. And you can choose a text from Hebrews 11 that tells us very uh, easily that Moses chose rather uh, to suffer affliction with the people of God than to in, uh, enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season. Uh, when you are lonely and fearful, you can call on Psalm 23, uh, the shepherd psalm, right? Uh, then uh, you must understand that when you grow bitter and critical, you can call 1 Corinthians chapter 13, that's the love chapter. Right? When you feel down and out, call uh, Romans 8.31. And when you want peace and rest, call uh, Matthew chapter 11. Right? For my yoke is easy, Jesus Christ says, and my burden is light. Take my yoke upon me, Jesus Christ says. Uh, when the world seems bigger than God, call Psalm 90. And when you want Christian assurance, call Romans chapter 8. Eight, when you leave home for labor or travel, call Psalm 121. And when your prayers grow narrow and selfish, call on Psalm 67. I leave you with those for now. Another time, we will take up a few more. But these emergency numbers are very important. Make sure for security purposes, you call upon these emergency numbers so that God can help you. God and Father, please be our shepherd today. And even though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, help us to fear no evil. Bless us throughout the day, I ask. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. God bless you. One word Christian soldiers marching us to war with the cross of Jesus going on before Christ the Rome.